Ford family, owner of the prestigious Grand Hotel Les Avants, above Lake Geneva, have been importing skis into Switzerland to entertain the clients since 1931. Louis Dufour, the son of the family, has just invented the first velvet skin, a news that will delight winter sports enthusiasts. Okay, Jeremy, dans 5. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, ça tourne. First memory of the first day here. In I don't remember anything. No, I think I remember the first time we came here. That was back in 1991. <laughs> 98, 99. 99. More than 20 years ago. My first memory that was, yeah, clearly on the chairlift. Two people chairlift, super slow. And then we were seeing uh, Nico and Doris. It's a cool. Jumping, crazy stuff beside of the chairlift. Oh. And they were shooting with, uh, with Yanchi, Guido, all together. To me, it was the Nicolas Cliff jump. The big, huge air. And I think he said, I'm going to jump off that. I think it was something like 30 meters. We said, you really, really want to jump off that? And I said, yeah, do it, do it, do it. <laughs> who, who cares? Let's, let's sell this photo. Get rich. <laughs> yeah, my main goal was to yeah, do the same as they were doing, just enjoying themselves in a, in a powder. That was the cool, that was the cool things to do. And it's still, it's still the case. Thanks to uh, Nicola and Loris that we discovered this area and then we skied it so many times. lines that you can ski. They're short, but they're really nice. Yeah. Really aesthetic. Well, they're steep. Steep, aesthetic. And how about deep? Yeah. And every time it seems like Maricot gets a bit more snow than over there. Yeah. My first memory of Jeremy, I think it's just there, just, just behind the camera somewhere. Super fun kid, a lot of energy, uh, ready to help us on different things and really want to learn, to learn a lot about how to make a film and how to, to skin the powder. For me, definitely the first memory was his, his ski technique from his racing background that he brought into the steeps. And it was just literally unbelievable. It's actually just beautiful to see such a such style and, 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 and technique. Uh, it blew me away at 16 years old. I was just one of the best skiers I'd ever seen. But my first memory of Jeremy, I remember him being very mature for his age. Gamma, also known as Gay Man. Gamma. Oh, Lady Boy. Lady Boy, and Gamma, and Gadildo. Um, Gadildo, Lady Boy, whatever. For sure, he was mature in the sense that he knew what he wanted. He followed you guys around, he followed us around, he carried, he helped, he worked at night, he, he was always there. He showed so much motivation and desire, and kind of, he, he knew at the age of 16 exactly where he wanted to be today. I don't think he would have expected to be where he is. Maybe. No, he doesn't have an ego, so he, I don't think he would have projected himself and said, I'm going to be one of the best years in the world at all. And, and he still doesn't act that way either. It's a beautiful day in Lima, Ricard. That was a natural evolution. We were like skiing slopes here. After that, we decided to start to hike and to reach all the lines, a little bit steeper 
in that tiny little resort. And after that, I took part of the, um, of the freeride world tour. And then I met uh, uh, Sami, Samantha Maten, and then we went exploring the 4,000 in the Alps. And now we are a little bit higher in 6,000. So it's been like really like a, a natural evolution. The evolution has been crazy. It's gone from skiing, nice little powder turns next to the piste and making a few jumps to, you know, huge mountains like Lenspitz or Bergabahorn. I don't know, there was a lot less people skiing where we used to ski. Now, yeah, everything gets tracked very, very quickly. That's a shame, but... But everything's changed. The, the equipment's changed so much with the, with the wider skis, the, the rocker, and now the bindings that you can walk with. You can so quickly just switch over and skin. But back in the day, if you wanted to really ski hard, we used to just like boot pack up everything just to be able to use our own proper skis. I've been using skins uh, a lot for the access, not only here, but uh, on, uh, on every expedition, it's, uh, it's the tool to have for sure. It's a natural evolution. We walk more and we go further to find the new fresh tracks. No, I hate walking, I hate skinning. <laughs> I'm fat and <laughs> old. I think the further he goes this way, the, 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 the better the snow will be. But if we're, if we're here... Well, exactly. We get the avalanche on the head. Exactly. And uh, it's perfect. Yeah. <laughs> it makes for a good ending. Buried on the road, doing what we love. <laughs> they live the dream, they'll say. They, they live the dream. <laughs>